They're like, how can you gain your respect back after some a kid shoots a condom in your face? You can't. <laughs> Hi, my name is Jason Sien. I was a full-time high school health teacher, and now I work part-time as a substitute teacher. Hi, my name is Jasmine. I'm a fifth grade teacher. I've been teaching for three years now, and I've been teaching fifth grade for three years now, which is objectively the best grade to teach. We're asking the class a question, which animal is pink? How about you in the front row? Cow. No. Does this just mean I yell no to the child's face? Oh! Oh! Everyone was happy that they got it wrong! Okay, in my class, if someone makes a mistake, we celebrate that. Mistakes are how we learn. Okay, I'm gonna check mark to see if this is a hippo or a dog. And I'm pretty sure this is a dog. Is this a game? Like... Oh, this... <laughs> I unlock hall monitor. Okay, this kid got it right last time, and he got it right this time. That's why they put glasses on him, which is very stereotypical. Thank you for being the kid that, you know, answers the teacher's question and puts us all out of our misery. I just earned $134. That's a better rate than I've ever seen for any teacher. So sign me up for this imaginary world. Oh wow, this guy, this is, <laughs> this is pretty cool. Okay, I actually kind of like this one. It's like a, it's like a little soothing. This is one of many things that I think are gonna come up in this game that I would absolutely immediately delegate to a classroom volunteer. Hey class, who wants to sharpen the pencils? You're gonna get 10 different kids and one of them is gonna be trustworthy enough to not turn them all into stubs. Sharpen this pencil. I just need to hold down a button. How do I know when to stop? Just kidding, I'm the student that doesn't know how to sharpen the pencil. As a kid, I used to like use any excuse to get out of my seat and like go sharpen a pencil and I got detention for it from one time from one of my teachers because they're like, you know the rules, you can't get up. I'm like, okay, first of all, that's a dumb rule. Okay, so I'm, I'm monitoring the halls, okay. Aw, she's upset. I think that she's telling me that she was helpful in class, which is a good thing, but she kicked the football onto the roof, which is a not so good thing. And she was sensible with a glue gun, which is a huge accomplishment for any kid in elementary school. I think I have the option to either send her to the principal, let her go, or spray her with a fire extinguisher. I would much rather, you know, like ask her how she's feeling, do a check-in question. Well, you know what? I'm gonna send this to the principal. Uh, that, the student's sad. <laughs> oh, there's a, there's a bullying. There's, there's that same kid's bullying someone. No, 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 no. My options are to stun them, to spray them again with this fire extinguisher, or let them go. Um, I do not want to lose my job. Oh, wow. So. The kid got electrocuted. I'm gonna have to let this kid go, which which is unfortunate. <laughs> and I was playing it wrong. Um, zero students were disciplined correctly. Well, you know, that's your opinion. <laughs> but I earned $114. Think of all the expo markers that'll buy. Oh, ooh, there's an actual fight. Oh, wow. Okay, this is, this is getting a little drama over here, which I, everyone likes a little drama. Should I break it up? or should I spray them with a fire extinguisher? I think I'm gonna spray them. Oh my gosh, this is not appropriate. Oh my gosh, oh no, 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 no. They're foaming up from the fire, oh my gosh, no. Uh, let me hit their legs instead, because, okay, this is, no, you, this is ridiculous. No, this is ridiculous. No. <laughs> okay, that was pretty fun. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna clean the board right now. Oh, okay, this is actually a little satisfying. I don't remember the last time I cleaned a whiteboard by myself because there is always five or six kids that desperately would like to clean that whiteboard for you. Draw. <laughs> okay, this is accurate because kids do like draw just wild stuff. Uh, if you give them like crayons you're, and you say have at it, you're gonna, you're gonna have a fun time. You know, it's funny because for when a lot of <laughs> I did for a lot of downtime for my students. I had them draw definitions of the words for like health or for different diseases, even for the high school students, because students, a lot of students like to draw. I want to give this person full props. They use multiple colors. They stayed within the lines. They combined different influences. And I appreciate the creativity. I've never, ever, 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 nor will I ever, failed a student for art. I want to give you full marks, and I don't know if the game will let me. Bad marking, I don't care. Congrats, friend. You deserve that A+. How all my kids look like when I give them their papers back. Yay! Ah! I'm gonna throw this in my backpack and never see it again, more like. Exam supervising unlocked! Bow, 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 bow. I don't like exam supervising. Now I'm finding the cheater in class. Oh! <laughs> I'm pretty tech savvy. I can use a lot of technology. But students these days, they're sharing their, 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 their tests 
through iPhone and through AirDrop. And sometimes, I, multiple times, I've gotten through from students like the answers to the test. I'm like, are you serious? But sometimes, to be honest, you can't see everything as a teacher. We pretend like we can see everything, but some students are so smooth where you just can't catch everything. Oh, oh, ooh, hello, hello. <gasps> oh, that was so sad. Lots to unpack there. Um, let's not yell at the children. I really try not to <laughs> yell things like get out at the children, even if that's what I'm thinking. I used to put students on blast all the time. Like, I'll make an example, but I've learned that that's not like the right way to do that because I'm putting this on blast just to make like appease my authority ego and that's not right. But again, that comes with maturity, which I'm mature now, I promise. How are those kids feeling out in the hallway? They didn't learn anything. They just learned that their teacher yelled at them. My kids don't cheat, right? Because my kids are going to see this video and they better not be cheating. Oh wow, I get a new outfit. So now I have horns and a shield. <laughs> I ha when I was teaching a sex ed lesson, for one of the things we like provided like condoms and stuff, and one of the students opened up the condom and flinged it in my face in front of everyone, and the students were recording and stuff. Like that's that was when I wish I had like a shield. So I'm just like venting now. <laughs> This game does not portray how hard it is to be a teacher. I do think they captured some of the funnest parts of teaching. I do really like looking at like the funny drawings the kids make for me. That gives me life, that gives me joy. I don't really understand the purpose of the game. Is it for students or for teachers? It's not really clear. It seems too advanced for some students. Oh, the bathroom? <laughs> not a single ch child has to go to the bathroom in this game. Inaccurate. I need a game where it's just trying to keep track of where your kids are. Where is Timmy? Have you seen Timmy? Because I don't know where Timmy is. My favorite part was the fire extinguisher part where I was like foaming the students to break up a fight. I would play that part again, but other than that, I wouldn't play this game again. I would have a parent-teacher conference with the creator of this app, and I would talk about all the many, many areas of improvement left to work on with this project. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and remember, don't forget to support your local teacher Teachers Union. Thank a teacher, show them some love because we're all out here just doing it for the kids. That's what it's all about. We always appreciate the support. Shout out to my fifth graders. I told you I was a cool teacher. <laughs>